Hi, <coughs> Assalamualaikum and a very good uh, morning and good day to everyone. Okay, so uh, I will <coughs> uh, introduce you uh, Thinkercad, which is we are going to uh, implement our lab session later uh, through this um, website. Okay. So, for those who have not uh, logged into Tinkercad, you can always uh, sign in, okay, to start, I mean, to start um, doing your account, okay, to start registering your account. Okay, so in my case, I have signed in, so I can join, okay. Oh, sorry, I can sign in. Okay, so this is uh, <clears throat> this is uh, the dashboard of the Tinker Cat. Okay, so for our class, we are going to use this uh, menu, which is circuits. Okay, so for example, I have uh, already uh, tried one circuit. Okay, so you if you want to build the new circuit, you can create a new circuit. Okay, so we wait for a while. Okay, so this is uh, the circuit that I have, uh, I mean, I have tried. Okay, so uh, this, the battery uh, is going to, to light up this LED. Okay, to give power to this LED. Okay, you can... Uh, change the parameters or the name of the battery okay for example if you have one battery so I name it as a input this is just example okay so whenever I click it so I know this is my input voltage so the LED okay so make sure that you um, connect the right, uh, the right uh, pin to positive and minus. Eh? For example, like this is my positive side of the battery. So I have to connect this positive to my anode. And the cathode, I need to uh, connect to the negative side of the battery. Okay, so we start the simulation. Okay, so... Uh, when we start the simulation, so the LED will light up, okay, because the circuit is correct. Okay, what if I accidentally uh, connect to the wrong uh, to the wrong side of the LED? So let's say I connect to here, okay, and then this one I connect to here. Okay, so I, I accidentally connect it wrongly. So let us see. So when we connect it, uh, when we connect it wrongly, we cannot uh, turn on the LED. Okay, so this is where you are going to use the simulation to see whether your circuit is correct or not. Okay. Okay, so uh, this is just a simple circuit. So later on, we are going to use Arduino in our simulation. Okay, so I will cancel this uh, circuit. So I delete. So to delete, I need to delete one by one. Okay, so let's say we are going to use Arduino. So you select the Arduino. Okay, so you can find one uh, example. So let's say uh, we try this example. Okay. So in this example, okay. I have a LED which is connected directly to my Arduino. Okay, so 
by using this Arduino, we can actually do the code here. Okay, to write your code, you can click to the code uh, menu. Okay, so here, this is actually a code block method. Okay, so we have to choose text method. Okay. Okay, so this is the text method. So this is the, <coughs> uh, the initial program that has been written for you. Okay, you can try and test it. Later on in your lab, you might be to uh, alter or to modify this program. Uh, basically, uh, based on your uh, requirement during the, uh, during the lab session. Okay, so let's say, uh, so this pin is connected to pin 13 at the digital side of the Arduino. So, if, uh, as you can see, the LED is connected to pin 13. Okay, so we assume that this uh, code is right and I think this is right. Okay, so, okay, we close the code. So, we can start simulate. Okay, so we see what the code uh, is all about. Okay, it says that it will turn on pin 13 and then it will give delay 1 second. So, it will be turned on for 1 second. And then after one second, uh, the pin 13 is uh, is fed with a low signal, so it will be turned low. Okay, so it will uh, it will be off for one second. So basically, one second on and one second off. Okay, so we close the code. So uh, we start the simulation, and then we see. Okay. Okay, see, the LED is blinking. One second off and one second on. So you are going to use this simulation to see whether your code is correct and your circuit is correct. Okay. So that's all for my uh, introduction on how to use Tinkercad. Shall see you again.